7 minus 2 gives us 5. And again, inside the parenthesis, we also have 7 minus 2. So someone might jump to the conclusion that 5 times 5 is 25 and assume that is the final answer. But that approach is not correct. Remember, the order of operations tells us to handle parentheses first, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. And multiplication and division share the same level of priority, so we work from left to right. The same idea applies to addition and subtraction as well. In this expression, we have a parenthesis, a multiplication, and a subtraction. Inside the parenthesis, there is a subtraction. And this part here represents multiplication because whenever a number is written right beside a parenthesis, it automatically means multiplication, even if the sign is not shown. So according to the rules, we begin with the parenthesis, then we handle the multiplication, and finally we do the subtraction. If we try to do the subtraction earlier, before the parenthesis or before the multiplication, the result will be incorrect. So let's follow the proper order. Inside the parenthesis, 7 minus 2 equals 5. Now the expression becomes 7 minus 2 times 5. At this point, we have one multiplication and one subtraction. Multiplication comes first. So 2 times 5 equals 10. Now we are left with 7 minus 10. And 7 minus 10 equals negative 3. So the correct answer to this expression is negative 3. Now it's your turn. What is 5 minus 2 times parenthesis 5 minus 2? Drop your answer in the comments. And before you go, make sure to subscribe, like, and share. And thank you so much for watching.